ist in Orte! Just you wait. A year on and some tosser will have invented the wankers of Novigrad faction. Excuse me. Leave the fuck alone. Get your men in me. Oi! Just you wait. A year on and some tosser will have invented the wankers of Novigrad faction. Why did he need changing? Leave it. Welcome. The tourney is on the way. Might I glance at your deck? Sure, here. An impressive array. Count Monnier waits inside. You may enter. Thanks. There you are. A pleasure to see you again. The Skellige faction. How do you find it? It's great. Faction's a pleasure to play. I'm glad to hear it. Any specific tournament rules? Mind giving me an overview? Firstly, might I introduce the contestants? Superb Gwent players all, hailing from the world's farthest corners. Hamal Ochen Dankbali, an Ofieri merchant. Eric van Frog, a patrician from Novigrad. And lastly, we are proud to welcome a Skelliger. Ye blind? Not Skelliger, Skelliger, damn it! Naturally, no offense meant. Agnetha Skolt, her effort charming isle temperament in evidence, along with assorted beats, baubles, ropes. As to the rules, they're simple. Each player adopts a faction they cannot change for the tourney's duration. Lose a match, and you're eliminated. The winner from among you shall advance to the semi final to face the winner of the tourney's previous edition. His Excellency the Ambassador of the Empire of Nilfgaard, Master von Hill. The winner of that match shall in turn face none other than me, your humble servant. Hand off our Gwent! No new fucking factions! Protesters have gathered outside. Quite a few, it seems. Hands off our bloody game! We didn't want any new factions! Money, you dozy cunt! Stop doubling with dwarven tradition! Change cannot always please everyone. Gwent traditionalists resent my efforts to expand the canon to include Skellige, but we shall pay them no mind. Mind telling me what factions the others will be playing? It is no secret. Eric van Frog will play the Northern Realms. His Excellency, in a flush of patriotism, chose Nilfgaard. Hamal Ochendagbali will play the Monster Stack, and Agnetha Skold has chosen Skoyatel. Yours truly, of course, shall await the winner with a Skellige deck. I'm determined to prove its value. Ready to start if everybody else is. I invite you to join me on the terrace. The Herald shall soon announce the tourney's start. Let the tourney begin! In round one, Agnetha Skult faces Eric von Vrog, and Geralt of Rivia plays Hamal on Gangbali. Let's grab a table. A wager, would you wish to make? 
What do you have in mind? Weapons do I collect, and your sword of silver my eye has caught. Should I win, I should take it. Should I lose to you another equally precious shall I give? All right. So be it.
just out of a tournament. Lost my sword, too. Thus in life goes it ever. One's fortune, another's misfortune requires. For a match good, thank I you. I'd never have lost if you hadn't cheated. And my land, folk who slander like that don't live long. Because we didn't let them. Accuse me of cheating again, and I'll cut your tongue out. Enough. Hands to yourselves. As Gwent is a gentleman's sport, we expect all its players to demonstrate impeccable manners, and we cannot tolerate any disturbances. Thus, by decision of Count Monier, the contestants from Novigrad and Skellige are hereby disqualified. Gentlemen's sport. Well, I'm a lady, and we the ladies don't give a flying fart about a tourney where any measly prick can accuse us of cheating. With round one completed, the standings are as follows. Geralt of Rivia eliminated. Agnetha Skold and Eric von Brog both disqualified. Consequently, His Excellency the Ambassador of Nilfgaard shall now face Hamal on Dalvali. Congratulations. Good win. Thank you. An exciting match, to say the least. In the grand finale, Ambassador Von Hin shall face Count Monier. Stop desecrating Gwent! Death to any and all new factions! Seems there's some trouble brewing. Scoot, Olius! Off your asses and hide to Skellige! Yeah, I love it, seal slurpers. Please remain calm and stop the verbal attacks. Stop your mum from fucking ferrets, Monier, and hands off our Gwent! Maybe instead of hollering threats, you ought to just explain what it is you want. We've said it plenty of times, yet no one ever listens! Got me listening. Gwent's an ancient pastime, as rules were set ages ago. Exactly. Determined in keeping with the laws of nature. There should be four factions. That is the optimal number. We'll not tolerate the introduction of any others. It would disgrace the tradition. Aye, leave our Gwent the fuck alone. Enough of this. Then come here to Java but to break fucking heat in defense of tradition. Come on, lads. Enough! I shall summon the guard! I got this, Count. Sure, you can shut this tournament down, but there'll be another, with who knows what new rules. If you don't like them, don't enter. Play somewhere else however you want, but you'll never stop other folk from playing however they like. Bollocks! Like my good friend Zoltan Chive says, if one says you're talking bollocks, they could be right, they could be wrong. But if multiples say you're talking bollocks, well, you probably are. So let's take a vote. Who else here thinks I'm full of it? Zoltan Chive! Haven't seen that rascal in ages. How's he doing? Zoltan's just fine. Attention, everyone! Our outing's taken a new turn. We're to sit and drink vodka with Zoltan's pal. Gentlemen, wait. We've still the final round of the tournament to play. I know. Fuck that. I, Yaki Raffiberg, to hereby declare my participation in this tournament. And I demand to play the victim. We'll settle whether this Skellige faction's worth a flaming bag of shit once and for all. Agreed, but please show some patience. We must first play a pre-final. In the, uh, 
the pre-final, Count Monnier, representing the Skelliger faction, shall face Ambassador Von Hin, playing Nilfgaard. Skelliger won. What a bundle of pish. Tournament's not done. Now, it's my turn. That is what we agreed. Let us resolve our differences here and now. The grand finale! Witness it now! Count Monnier playing the Skelliger faction against Yaki Rappiberg. Playing... Skyatel! Let the better man or dwarf win! Well played. Thank you for a scintillating game. Trust my victory has convinced all doubters of the value of the new faction. You won because you played better. Even if you hadn't played as Plowing Skelliger, you would have won anyhow. Uh, congrats all the same. Yaki Raffiberg's no sore loser. Come on, lads. Let's get soused. No, you must stay, for I wish to treat you all to a tipple. We must toast the premier of the new faction. And if anyone wishes to play a friendly match with Gwent, I see no reason why not. Thank you for everything, Witcher. No problem. Had fun. I'm sorry you did not manage to qualify for the finals. I'd hoped to face you, but participation alone counts for something. Here, the consolation. Thanks. I am glad to have met you. I desire to do one more thing for you, Witcher. Such is my nature. Is there any way I could be of service? During the tournament, I lost my silver sword. I'd like to get it back, because that's how I earn my wages. I believe I shall be able to help. Would you be so kind, good sir, as to agree to return Geralt his sword? in exchange for a blade once belonging to the famed knight Ridigir. Yes, but the sword of Ridigir in the sands of time sank. I assure you, that is far from the truth. In that case, it's settled. Fine is this blade. May it continue to well serve you. Thank you, Count. And you, sir. Generosity is a virtue. Thank you once more for deigning to take part in my little tournament. I hope we shall meet again. Who knows? Farewell. Hey! Primal participation is, whereas vindicating victory would be. What's that? Yes. You shan't find anything better in all Tucson. Something of Witcher? I wonder what brings him here. Leave me in peace, Witcher. Never. I eat the fullness of blood and this fall on Tucson. You is must loosen up, else you'll pop a cork. Beg your part, take good care of yourself. You'd best behave, friend. You're in the.